So guys, in this, this video, I'm gonna show you a, a few, well not a few, a bunch of things you could use to get the lawn prepared for fall. Now right now, we're at the end of August, still summertime, September is coming up. Summertime for me doesn't end to September 22nd, but these tips will help you get your lawn prepared for fall, guys, so check it out. So guys, on this table, I got a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff. And I'm just going to get straight to it, guys. One of the things I would tell anybody is because of this wishy-washy weather we've been having, guys, it's still not too late to put a fungus control down. Now, fungus controls are not for the entire season. Generally, they only last anywhere from 25 to 45 days, mostly around about 30 days. Guys, if you got the hose in liquid, spray it on your yard. If you got the granular, go ahead and put it out also. Now, the liquid works a whole lot faster than the granular but the granular seems to last longer than the liquid now if you want for those pro guys you want to step up to the purple connell's all 14 3 guys that's a great choice also but this is a whole lot easier to apply this is a little bit more complex to apply but this works a whole lot better okay guys the next thing i would like to talk about is insect control now if you've been following me guys you see me picking up this stuff at dirt cheap paid like two three dollars a bag for this covers 8,300 square feet right here, guys. Not as potent as the, the name brand, but still works. Guys, if you have any of this left, granular, put it over the entire yard based on the rate. And this right here, cutter, got a video for this right here, guys. This stuff works great. It's September, this stuff says it lasts about 12 weeks. So if you do spray this on your yard, it's gonna work real good. Now, one thing I want you to bear in mind, says it lasts 12 weeks probably won't but when you're putting product like this down guys the best thing to do is always mulch because any residue it just keeps getting mulched back into the lawn when you start bagging it you start cutting that grass it goes up into the moor and you take away from the effectiveness of this product right here now guys this product right here is not necessarily for the grass but it's for the landscape and it's the three-in-one insect disease of mite control guys if you spray this on your your um, bushes your shrubs flowers good for roses right here guys this is going to help protect that last little bit now generally come fall you don't really see a lot of insects hanging around but if you do it's going to work real good for that it's also going to control some of the diseases that you could possibly get still so it's a great product to use i got a video for this matter of fact at the end of this video i'm just going to link a bunch of videos that i'm talking about and you can watch that playlist Okay guys, I wanna show you this product right here. This is not for the lawns. This is Roundup with the uh, glyphosate in, but this is the one that only has, I think about 2%. Great for little areas like this where you see some of these stubborn weeds or Bermuda grass don't wanna go away. Guys, when you spray this stuff right here, don't skeet it like you're going crazy. Just kinda of taste it in those spots. Try to do this when you know no rain is coming. And you'll see those weeds and grass start to die off like I previously sprayed. You can see them dying off right there. Great little product for curb cracks and stuff like that also. Okay, guys, I want to talk about this right here. Weed control. If you're still having weeds in your lawn, and you don't really hear a lot of people talking about treating weeds in the lawn in 100 degree weather because it says on the bottle, anything over 90 degrees, my cutoff point is 80. But now that temperatures are starting to cool down, still a great time to go ahead and treat for those weeds if you still got them. I love the Spectricide Weed Stop for Lawns 470. It's not the best product in the world, but it works great and it doesn't really cost that much. I got other products that you could use right here. Weed Clear uh, for Lawns right here by Ortho. A little bit more expensive product. And these are concentrates right here, guys. If you could put it in one of these bottles, hook it up to the hose in spray and spray the yard that's good now if you have the individual bottles you can spot treat for those weeds you can kill them off and check this out for your flower beds ladies this is the best part i'm telling this thing right here use this right here kind of throughout the season right here but it still works great in the fall if you have those weeds in the beds okay guys fall fertilizer so now i've always said that the best time to prepare your yard is in the fall. Let me let me talk to the camera. All right, guys. Now, when fall comes along, like I said, we're here we are in the end of August, which is still summertime. But the question becomes, do you f actually fertilize your Bermuda grass while it's about to go dormant 
in the fall that answer can go either way now i love this particular product right here the sunny land all natural animal organite you could put it down really doesn't have a real nitrogen in it has some nitrogen in it it's not going to push growth and it's still going to help condition the soil all right conditioning the soil is important but one of the better products i would advise you to apply is the yard mastery 7020 that cannot be bought in any store guys i'm gonna leave a link down in the description you can order if you want to but it's one of my staples and here's the common misconception about 7020. now this is an actual bag of yard mastery 7020 right here guys this video is non-sponsored for those of you want to say something guys i love using this product me personally the my last real application of fertilizer real fertilizer be set to me the first i gotta throw it off a little bit this year because i took a late summer hit for as a uh green hit so i had to go ahead and put it out and put down a recovery product but i want to show you this right here this can be applied early spring summer is when we know to put this down all right but late fall and the reason they say late fall is this guys that 20 percent potash is going to get down into that soil this helps protect against frost also from from a hard freeze it'll protect your roots great time to put it down for your warm season grass it's late fall not early fall now for cool season they got summer and fall so fall is a great time to put this product down also okay here's another great product guys you're gonna have to read your product label for us to put this down but my suggestion with bermuda grass it, here we are late summer almost i would apply this now as long as the temperatures are not over 90 degrees all right and the reason i say that killing weeds is fun and you still can do it regardless of what time of the season it is but if you notice one thing this is a 1601 not a lot of fertilizer in this formula right here so the push is not going to be hard on your bermuda grass you're primarily putting it down to kill some weeds. It has a pre-emergent in it that's supposed to last four months. It's like I said, it's a three-in-one, so you don't have to worry about pre-emergent per se if you put this down. And it's going to give it a little bit of feeding throughout the rest of the season. Now, my absolute last fertilization, long as the grass is still has some greenness and actively growing, would be this all-organic plant-based lawn food. It's a 1002 right here. Made in the USA, I must say, covers up to 5,000 square feet. These products are pretty good, purely organic, stuff like that. You're not going to get a lot of push. To me, personally, it's more of a soil conditioning uh, fertilizer, but this stuff does work great right here. Kind of expensive, though, when you start looking at the cost per 1,000 square feet, but it's something to think about. Okay, guys, last but not least, and remember, there are other products out there. But that Hydratane ES Plus, and they got a four play that supposedly came out, did not receive any yet. But these are also great right here, guys. If you're looking for water management, this product works great. Some of you guys won't be able to water your lawns because of restriction. You guys in Texas, I know you're not watering your lawn. But if you have moisture in the soil, it's going to help pull moisture towards those roots. And you can use this stuff all season. Would not apply it in the dead of winter when it's absolutely freezing but it, this is not a plant food this is just to help with the watering situation you may have so okay yard fanatics i gave you a couple of great tips there guys let me know if you have any additional tips that you want to share with the community guys put them in the comments man go lengthy on it tell everybody exactly what you're doing to prepare your bermuda grass or your zoysia or whatever type of lawn cool season that you have this year getting it ready for fall Guys, you are tuned into Bermuda Grass Central with BYD. This is Michael Bowman, and I'll talk to you soon.